I knew that I was going to meet uh, different people from different countries, and I was just open to whatever the adventure brings to this experience. No matter if they are from a different culture, you will always find some stuff in common, and you realize that you are actually from the same planet. So that's the best part, to realize that we are not that different. We are still in the same line. Home is a place where you feel confident, where you feel certain level of freedom. And I have found that here in, in Lati, for example, I have met lots of people, so they are my new family. So it's like a new home. Uh, I think it's up to you. You can set home whatever you want. People, in general, that's what I miss the most. Homemade food from my country, my family, my friends. Sometimes I, I have a little bit of homesick, naturally. I'm a human being. <laughs> no matter, I'm having fun here, but of course there are, there are days that I would like to have them closer. I think there are always ups and downs. When you live in a student accommodation, of course, you have a very dynamic um, kind of life. There's always something happening, a party or just a um, meeting with students for lunch or sharing your food, you want to share your culture, there's always something happening and that occupies your mind. So the low moments maybe are the ones when you are alone, of course, this um, before sleeping or when you wake up in the morning. You can have plenty of reflexive, uh, reflective moments. Um, sometimes when you are walking to university alone and you are surrounded by the, the trees and the landscape all covered in snow, everything is white, you start thinking about from simple stuff like just appreciating the beauty in a snowflake till more emotional and personal stuff. But most of the times I just want to I, I wish I could record what my eyes are seeing when I'm walking because I feel like I live in a postcard that is just for this moment and I want to capture that in my mind. Being an international student, just living different exchanges, is both rewarding but also challenging. I left in my country my best friends, then I moved to Glasgow and I made new friends that then I left behind again to come to Finland. It's, you are like a social nomad, but it opens your mind. It's like reading books. I mean, meeting people is like reading books and every single one is a new story for you. Exchange experiences are precisely about exchanging not only the same classroom but exchanging life experiences maybe in the past you were just trapped in a corner of the world no matter the age people in the world should have the chance to live at least once in a different country it opens your mind it gets you mat more mature you change your perspective about everything yeah, it's absolutely rewarding.